Hey! <laughs> Will be the 800,000 naira will be one man last year with their girlfriend disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> they supposed to thank God now. By now, now. <laughs> Another thing for don't enter. <laughs> How they want they feed. <laughs> Now we be said to even feed yourself na your heart. <laughs> it can't be when you get wife. <laughs> hey, what the, what the? <laughs> I know say people will not get money and then they burn pass. <laughs> <laughs> As the marriage they start, your wife don't carry the lay immediately. <laughs> <laughs> People where they earn less, less salary. <laughs> you know they had the wife to carry the leg. <laughs> you go call them, call them plan as you want to do family planning. Your wife go tell you, say, baby, I think I missed my period. <laughs> you call them in dilemma. <laughs> you don't know whether to celebrate <laughs> or to get angry. <laughs> Because person will marry the next pet make it born now. <laughs> On the other hand, <laughs> money no day. <laughs> if to say your girlfriend no disappoint you that last year, you can't marry. <laughs> By now, if an awful internet, they find those people where they shout, manifest. <laughs> what you eat will come. <laughs> Where I will start from. <laughs> now rise you won't use 50k buy. <laughs> if you buy a finish, you don't buy tomato. <laughs> <laughs> you suppose as you day like this now, you go find that girl will disappoint you. Go meet her for your house, buy him card. Tell her say, baby, you really saved my life. <laughs> <laughs> but I said the girl see future. <laughs> you see this shake coming around. <laughs> by now, now you for compose that African China song they sing by this time. Food do not day. African China own be say sing them. Make it ten Nigeria waiting they happen. <laughs> Your own for sing them out of passion. <laughs> Now your neighbor go to talk say, you see that way that guy they talk? Eh? I'm waiting in the past room. <laughs> but now all those people when they even they tell you say, manifest now. Marriage is not all about money. If they look up like say enemy of progress, <laughs> you don't want my survival. <laughs> Mamma mia! Well, let me say first of all that I'm not into the needy greedy. Needy greedy can be taken care of by the experts, and we have a lot of them out there that we can borrow. In fact, the US itself, the US government itself, will be willing. The World Bank will be willing. All other development partners will be willing to address the issue of hunger. Uh, <coughs> uh, CH, Kade the Harmonize, is, is an organization that provides. It actually came out with a figure, scaring figure, that two, about 26.5 million Nigerians in 2024 will face the challenge of food insecurity. And as far as I'm concerned, the food insecurity can be worse than the banditry and all these uh, security threats that we find along. So uh, it's very important for government to uh, embrace any, uh, any way. And one of the best ways is the food stamp. It was introduced in the United States in 1939. Up to date, the only thing they do is to try to improve on it. Mm -hmm. And because of what the social uh, this thing attached to it, they now change the name to SNAP. Yeah. Supplementary uh, nutrition, uh, nutrition assistance program. Assistance program. And, but in any way, this is better than what we are doing. That is the cash 
conditional cash, conditional transfer, cash transfer and you keep on pumping money into it and you don't see the result but this one is simple and it can be started tomorrow tomorrow if you say well, let's do it it can be done how, how do you get the database it's not data. Yeah, that is why you get the wrong. we are not talking about data we are talking about people all the data they are using now is fake most of it is fake what data do you need than you have your identity card? If you don't have a national identity card, you will have a BVN. If you don't have BAVN, you have a proof. And you can go to your local locality. Nobody will go out and fake uh, the issue of food to collect food. The Borno State government is doing its own, but not the, uh, the way. But the governor, you can see, whenever he gets money on the monthly or in interval basis, they issue our tokens. Tokens. If they go to a town or village, they announce that tomorrow food will be distributed. People will come out and collect their ration. I think the day before yesterday, they did the same thing. So when you get the token, 10, you go to where you will now submit the token uh -huh. and collect food. Well, collect food. So now, if the government gives you the token for a valued amount, then you go to the market, designated places where a food stamp can be accepted. It's just like where you use credit card or where you use POS, whether you use this thing, they will write it there that uh, so, so, so is being, is acceptable. You go there, collect a, you know, either is a cup of gari, a cup of rice, and you, you issue out, you, instead of paying with money, that is the most effective way. I'm not saying that the conditional cash transfer com should be completely abandoned. All right. But if you introduce food stamp, you will see it. You will see the result immediately. So they should go hand in glove. Yes, hand in glove. But okay. that of uh, the food stamp is not the issue of, or of course, there will be people that will tap what corners, steal some part of it, but not as simple as stealing money. Now, when they say you are doing data, when you see data, you will see somebody's name. They will put foul name. If you get, uh, you say Kaza. If you say Kaza to an Englishman, <laughs> he will think it's a name. But Kaza is actually foul. And then you will transfer uh, uh, money to foul account. That is what they do. But if you say Kaza, in, in terms of food stamp, that Kaza must go and collect food. This one has to do with our political class. What is all this struggle all about? You want to kill, you want to bury. What is it all about? What is the struggle all about? I will answer you. The struggle, we are not talking politics. In 2006, I wanted to be a deputy governor. So the then deputy governor invited me and told me that this office has no money. There is nothing in it. I don't know why you see the seats on moving me from here and taking over. So, a woman who went with me said, Your Excellency, then don't wait for impeachment. Just resign since there is nothing in it. And he stood up and he started punching the woman. And I told him, Your Excellency, don't punch her. She's telling the truth. There is nothing in the office. That's why I want it. Because you are too big for it. So, Your Excellency, Governor Fupara, if there is nothing in the struggle, don't struggle. Our own governor of River State has given us one of the best messages we take home today. One of the so such a message we take home today. If everyone understands that we should not be struggling, can we put our hands together for our governor, please? Amen. We brought nothing to this world, we'll go out with nothing. Whether you like the struggle or not, you will struggle out one day. Praise the Lord.